No, I'd always talk about writing a book, but it's, you know, it's either easier said than done. And with everything that's going on in the world, you know, I just, I just felt like I needed to re-engage people that didn't always hear the gospel. And my wife, Charlene, convinced me that I had had a lot of experience and it would be foolish to take that, what I had learned, the lessons I had learned from all that experience, you know, to the grave that I need to share with my children, both and foremost and her grandchildren, but that there was an audience out there, an audience of, you know, young people, veterans and their families, uh, people who know veterans and uh, try to get their heads around situations that they face is so unique. Why it's important that we increase public awareness of some of the challenges that they face. I knew it would take a lot of time and a lot of effort. I wasn't sure what the message would be. I, I wasn't sure how my story would resonate with me. But I worked with that for about three years and, and, and looked at what I had done, my manuscript, but it was not, it was not, it didn't have the message that I wanted. And that's when I, I reached out to the two of you. And, and after about the third interview, you helped me see what that message, you know, that what the message was. And I knew that exactly, that's exactly what I wanted to do. Mm. And then back and took that huge manuscript and then condensed that down and you and I worked together you know, to produce the final product that we're about to release. And I'm excited about this. It's exactly what I wanted to do. It, but it, you know, it just takes, you know, God connects us with people that helps us to figure these things out, you know, and he, so he can move us in the direction he, want, he wants us to go. I feel a great sense of satisfaction knowing that I, I did the impossible and did exactly in my heart what I wanted to do.